The steps you took to figure out the cause of the ocean edge sea otter decline are very similar to what scientists do every day to try to stop a species from becoming extinct. Unfortunately, humans greatly affect the long-term chances of an ecosystem's survival. For instance, over 50% of the world's species are found in tropical rainforests. These areas are being destroyed at alarming rates by human activity. Many species will become extinct before scientists have identified them. Overfishing of oceans and lakes and environmental mismanagement in general can lead to thousands of species becoming endangered. If we don't protect species from extinction, animals like the southern sea otter could disappear in a matter of years. Their extinction could cause a chain reaction of problems, including overgrazing of kelp by sea urchins, which could alter kelp forest ecosystems. This in turn could lead to the loss of many other species that rely on those kelp forests. It's important for humans to find ways that plants, animals, and humans can all live together in balance. Such efforts are taking place right now in Madagascar, where we are working with its citizens to figure out how to coexist with the humpback whales. Understanding how all living things are interconnected is the first step. Once humans realize we are one of many species here on Earth, we can better understand how our actions affect all other living things around us and help protect Earth's environment for the future. This mission is officially complete. The center will be sure to call on your team with its next important assignment. Return to Seeker Central to quit.